Hi, my name's Chris. Welcome to my studio. In this short video, I want to show the unboxing of my brand new watercolor brushes by Dugato. Let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome to my studio. This is Chris. I just received in the mail this brand new set of watercolor brushes and I wanted to, to do a quick unboxing with you. I've never uh, used these before. Again, brand new, just got them. They are the Dugato Squirrel Hair, uh, Squirrel Hair Paint Brushes for watercolor. And I'm just gonna go ahead and open them up here. And they are made in China. This particular set includes four brushes and um, they were $37 US. Uh, again, prices can vary depending on when you're depending on when you're listening to this, watching this video or where you're purchasing them. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and take a look at them. Nice box uh, that they come in here. And uh, when you open that up, you can see they've packaged the uh, four brushes really nicely. And that's always a real plus. Uh, they're all um, they're all held into place inside the packaging uh, with some some string as well as the uh, bristles here on each brush are protected with a plastic sheathing. Really like that. That's super important um, to make sure that they're uh, that they get transported safely without it being damaged. Uh, in the instructions online, they do say that there's sizing. In, in the brush bristles. Let me move uh, this box out of the way just for a second so you can see it against the contrasting uh, of the uh, tabletop. So we see here um, that the uh, brush bristles are very, uh, they're actually um, not soft at all. So don't be dismayed by that when you open them. Uh, of course, they have sizing in them, which is uh, some kind of a, oh, I'm not exactly sure what they make sizing out of. Um, a substance that they put on the brushes and then it dries and it keeps them very stiff and it keeps them from being damaged in uh, in transport, in shipping. And that's important and almost all brushes do that. Again, these are squirrel hair brushes. So uh, squirrel hair is exceptionally uh, good for watercolor painting, which is what I do. Um, and they, the reason being it holds, squirrel hair holds a lot of water and paint. And so you can get a lot of water and, and just paint without having to go back into your palette or, or water container. Um, and that's a real advantage. It's also soft. The bristles are very soft. And uh, that's nice for, uh, again, for painting. Uh, I like to paint with a soft brush for the most part. And also, finally, they keep a very good tip or point. And that is also very important. You, you, if you can get a combination of a big belly on your brush combined with a really fine point, if you can get both those things in one brush, that's a really great brush. Now these are would be considered a quill brush style, meaning they have this sheathing here where uh, at the ferrule, which is what this is called, where the handle uh, connects to the bristles of the brush um, here at the heel of the bristles or, or this end, uh, there's a plastic sheathing over it. And now over that, they've decided to use, it looks like copper metal. I'm not exactly sure if it's copper, but some kind of metal here that they've twisted and made really tight. And in their instructions, they, they talk about how the, the uh, technique they've used here to attach the, uh, the bristles to the handle at the ferrule uh, the technique they've used here in twisting this metal has made it very, very strong and very sturdy. So here you go. You can see in a more close-up uh, manner the ferrule, the metal that's been twisted. And they uh, have twisted it so tight that it's actually embedded a little bit into the wood. Now, some people, when they get these brushes and they see this plastic part here, they think you're supposed to remove that or something because they wonder why there's a plastic sheathing over the brush. Uh, absolutely not. This is part of the construction of the brush. Uh, and again, it's, it's called a ferrule, uh, the place at which the handle and the bristles connect. And so again, this set has four brushes in it. 
Uh, this is the largest, a size six. So this is uh, the largest of the brushes, a size six. Next brush is the four. And again, I'll take off the sheathing uh, that's protecting it there. Next is the size two. And finally, the size zero. So that's the entire set. Again, I was able to purchase them via Amazon for about $37. So that is less than $10 per brush, which I think is an exceptional value for squirrel hair, natural hair brushes, especially because of just the quality of, of using squirrel hair. So I haven't used them yet, obviously just opened them. I will do a quick review of these and actually try them out in another video, but I just wanted to show them to you really quick so you could see how they were packaged. Um, and just my first kind of first impressions, again, this box that they come in and, um, that would be a really nice place to store the brushes if you wanted to. Um, so you can see that there. Uh, overall, my first impressions are positive, uh, but the real proof is in the painting. So I will give them a try and post another video once I get that up. Thanks for watching. See you next time.